Hi ladies, Jackie Sabrin here with my giant goggle glasses and I wanted to talk to you if you're feeling stuck or unlucky in love, I wanted to address that. So I came down to the beach, it's a couple blocks from my office because of course of the eclipse, there's a lot of people walking around outside looking at the sun and I just thought, I don't want to be sitting in my office when I can go down to the beach and so I found this beautiful hibiscus flower on the way down here and I know I'm feeling like I'm having an oversized day, it's like large than life flower but it's so pretty so I wanted to share that with you but um, so what I wanted to talk to you about is are you feeling stuck or unlucky in love um, I know that a lot of women dating whether you're online or offline it's really hard to navigate um, going through this process of attracting your soulmate because what happens is we're constantly challenged to step out of our comfort zone and in the process that triggers in the process what happens is it triggers our um, our approval issues and it, it triggers our fear of rejection we don't want to be rejected so we get out there and and we'll put ourselves out there a little bit and then we'll we'll we won't hear back from a man or somebody may not give us the response that we want so that we'll withdraw and think about it. So we'll spend time thinking about what he said, what I said, why he didn't call me. And in that process, what happens is you actually create a, an emotional block for yourself because you are not present. So the time you spend thinking about all of the things you're saying and doing and, and your past mistakes and all of that processing takes you out of the present moment where all your power is. See, we have to train ourselves. You, you have to learn to be more present in the moment. And I'm going to host another live webinar on, on Wednesday night at 6 p.m. Pacific where I'm going to give you the key to, um, to changing all of this because it's really a critical piece that you really need to learn in order to master dating but really master the game of life it's really bit much bigger than that because when you discover this key that keeps you more present you don't fall into these little ditches emotionally or emotional ruts because when you do that you're really you're you're really not present and you're going into the past or you're worrying about the future and so it's taking you out of the now where all your power is and so I'm really excited about this training because I know this little nugget is going to have a massive impact so it's a little tip and it's gonna have a massive impact just like sitting down here at the ocean and let me show you where I am right now it's just so pretty I'm down here near the La Jolla Cove look at this beautiful beach Isn't that gorgeous yeah I just want to share that with you there's a little park here where there's a lot of weddings um, I considered having my wedding there, but decided it wasn't the right place. I wanted to be right on the beach. So I hope you'll join me Wednesday night where I'm going to share the key to help you to um, stop the self-sabotage, stay more present, um, let go of the past, um, bring all that juicy feminine energy into the now where you'll magnetize a man right to you. I know that sounds like a cliche, but I get really excited about this because it's the truth. Um, I know that's what you want. Do you want to be happy with a man? You want to um, stop dating and put all of this behind you and start living your life more fully. And so you just need a few skills in order to do that. And that's why I'm passionate of teaching you this because life, there's so much more to life just in this very moment right now. I'm just noticing the sound of the ocean and the trees the palm trees are swaying and I can feel my watch on my wrist and I'm just staying really grounded on this bench that I'm sitting on and right now here in this very moment there I don't have a problem in the world sure do I have bills and do I have responsibilities and obligations absolutely but right now in this moment moment by moment everything's perfect it's perfection I couldn't make it any more perfect and so um, I want to teach you this amazing quality where your life you don't have to change your lifestyle. You don't have to give anything up um, to, to, to know this secret that I'm going to teach you on Wednesday night. You just need to bring more presence. And you need to bring yourself to my webinar. So I'm going to post the link to sign up. It's free, of course. And you can connect with me in that live training. And I want to just say hi to a couple of the ladies. Hi. Hi, Tammy. Hi, Susie. Do you like my big flower, my giant hibiscus, and my giant glasses? Ladies, the I, let me share something that's really um, interesting. These glasses I got in 1990. Look at them. They're old school Versace's, and I actually bought them right here in La Jolla. Um, 
you know, all these years ago, 20 whatever years ago, when I was living on Maui, I would come here and I bought these sunglasses and I always liked them. And so I thought, I'm going to, I'm going to bring, bust out those old sunglasses. I have, I have a lot of old sunglasses. I really like keeping them because they're so fun. Look how big they are. Remember the days when we wore these giant sunglasses? Does anybody have any big sunglasses like this? Tammy, do you have any? And Susie, what about you? <laughs> So you live in a warm climate, both of you, so you probably can relate to having a, a collection. So go out and pick yourself a beautiful flower and put it in your hair because it's really, um, really fun and feminine thing to do. Hope you're having an amazing day, all of you. Sending you lots of love. I'm wait, I want to hear what she said. Oh, thank you. Okay, bye girls. Talk to you later. I'm going to give you one more shot of the ocean. Isn't that pretty? Okay, bye-bye.